Trending tonight, State Attorney General Mark Burnovich is going after vaping companies. Today, the AG announced two lawsuits against Juul Labs and Eon Smoke, two vaping companies. Max Gordon joins us with reaction to today's announcement. We know that the extent of this crisis is major, and we know that something to, had to be done. Surrounded by confiscated vaping products from Arizona schools, today AG Mark Burnovich announced action aimed at combating what he calls an epidemic. We are opening a new front by filing two lawsuits against the two major players in the vaping industry, the e-cigarette category, that's Juul Industries as well as Eon Smoke. The state wants the manufacturers to pay tens of thousands for getting kids hooked on nicotine, for both companies to permanently stop advertising targeting youth, and to stop selling flavored vape products in Arizona. Today is the next step in that evolution, in that movement to cut down on teen and underage tobacco use. Eon Smoke didn't return a request for comment, but in a statement, a spokesperson from Juul said that while they haven't yet reviewed the complaint, they want to work cooperatively with attorneys general across the U.S. Here at GK's Vapor Pub, they sell a wide variety of vaping products and flavors, but you might be surprised by the owner's reaction to today's announcement. If our AG has determined that they're bad actors, that's within his powers to go after the bad actors. I can't really argue with that. Gunnar Bertel says his shop doesn't sell Eon Smoke or Juul. I, I'm not a fan of the product, to be honest. And while he doesn't support a flavor ban, he is in favor of keeping vapes away from kids. We're not a bunch of criminals and thugs. Like, I want, I, I want to help where I can and give adults the choice. Max Gordon, Arizona's Family.